Hey everyone, today I'm going to show how you can create keyboard shortcuts in OS X that work in the same way as they do on iOS. So you may be familiar with iOS 5 and the fact that it contains a keyboard shortcut option. And basically the idea behind it is that you can type in a phrase that you might type that's just a couple letters long. And then put a sentence or a, several words in so that once you type the default set of letters, it will replace it with a phrase of your choice. So Apple includes an example which is on my way, which they abbreviated with the shortcut OMW. So you can see how it works. And many people found this feature in iOS 5 as something new, uh, but actually it's been around in Mac OS 10 for quite a while now. And it's here in Lion as well, and you can actually do it. But not a lot of people know about it because it's kind of hidden and off to the side out of the way. So if you've ever used something like Text Expander, this works in a similar way, although it is a little bit more limited. So all you have to do to set this up is open up System Preferences. So you can launch this up. And now in System Preferences, you're going to go into Language and Text. And in Language and Text, you have all these menus. Here's all the different languages and everything. But what you want to do is just forget about the rest of that and go over to the Text tab. And over in the Text tab, this is where you set this all up. So you can see a list on the side here of different shortcuts. And there's ones automatically included with the OS, like some of these fractions and things like that. Now, if you're interested, this is also the area in Lion where you can turn off uh, automatic spelling correction. So if you don't like autocorrect, you can get rid of that here too. And there's actually a lot of different things within this language and text panel that you can change and tweak to your liking. So you can see here that I've already set up a demo shortcut, and this is like the one that Apple includes in iOS, where I changed on my way to this shortcut. So all I have to do is type OMW. But let's say I want to add another one. And let's say I want this one to be for my name. So let's say I want to type in MS. And then when I type that, I want it to replace it with my name. So I can do something like that and hit enter. And there you go, you have created a shortcut. And it's really that easy. And this is actually really handy. There's a lot of different uses for it that you might not know of. And one that I've really come to love is the fact that you can enter a shortcut in for an email address. So for example, let's say I want to set up a shortcut here. So let's say when I type in MS email, it will replace it with my email address. So it's really handy. And if you fill out forms a lot, or if you're logging in and you, you know, you're using emails, things like that, it's really handy that you can just type in a shortcut and you don't have to type out an entire email address. And I find that it works really well for a lot of stuff like that. Now, another thing you can do with this, and it's new with Lion because there wasn't the emoji option before Lion, is you can set different emoticons, basically, and you can assign them to the emoji features in OS X. So let's say I want to do a smiley face. Now, if I go over to the input sources tab here, what I can do is I can select keyboard and character viewer. And now if I go up to your menu bar, you'll see that it appears and I can select Show Character Viewer. Now this menu that pops up here will have all the different characters that you can insert. So let's say I want to go over to text and I want a smiley face for this shortcut that I'm creating. I can go in here and I can drag in a smiley face and hit enter and there it's created that shortcut for me. So now whenever I type a smiley face, I'll replace it with the emoticon. Now, if you want to test these out to make sure that they're working correctly, you can open up text edit over here and you can try them out. So let's say I try on my way, just like the one that Apple has on iOS. Now, as soon as I hit space, bam, it turns into on my way. And I can do the same thing for my name. So MS turns into my name and MS email turns into my email address. And then of course, the smiley face that I set up turns into the emoticon smiley face. So there you go, and it's just like the way it works in iOS. It's a little bit more limited than something like Text Expander, but it is very handy, built right into the OS. A lot of people don't know about it, so I thought I'd share it with you today. So there you go, that's how you can set up iOS style keyboard shortcuts right within Mac OS X. If you have anything that you'd like to see me do how to, make sure to send me an email. I hope you found this video useful. Thank you for watching.